Good questions. Um, so let's uh, start with uh, Mike Cabbage, who's standing on the wall there. <coughs> Mike Cabbage with the Orlando Sentinel. I've got a couple. Um, first for Leroy, if when you look at the weather tomorrow morning, you the forecast. We're going to look at the storm again tonight, and uh, we plan to get together early tomorrow morning and take a final look. And uh, based on the current timetable, we uh, plan to make our decision one way or the other um, by a 7 a.m. tomorrow morning. And the decision will be uh, specifically to start into rollback preparations. Our friends on orbit supplied this for us, obviously. Gives you a good idea of the, of the magnitude of the storm. Um, it would take a, a, a relatively significant change from the current forecast uh, that we're seeing um, to prevent us from going into rollback preparation. And um, I would just put it to you that way. Um, and if we see that, then um, if we see a change like that, then, then we'll press on. And uh, if we don't, then we'll begin our rollback preparations. And of course, rollback preparations means just that. Um, and uh, the vehicle would still physically be at the pad until Tuesday about noon when we actually um, jack uh, the vehicle up and start doing the rollback. Mike, and uh, it's a good question. Basically, I believe the time on the screen you're seeing is a, is a GMT time um, that equates to something just before 2 